Hello everyone, this is a lesson on body mass index, usually called BMI. The formula that we use to calculate body mass index, we use the mass in kilograms and the height in meters squared. The body mass index is used to measure whether somebody is overweight, obese, or it's a normal weight. So here, there's a table, this table for body mass index. It's saying that if you calculate the body mass index and you get 18.5, it means that person is underweight. They need to eat some more. If it's between 18.5 and 24.9, they're normal. So when you calculate it and get a value, you'll take that value and compare it to a table that you are given that you are given in that particular question and then you can tell if that person is overweight is normal or is obese let's look at um some few examples on how you calculate the body mass index okay the first example that you're going to look at it says what is the body mass index of a person who has a mass of 73 kilograms with a height of 1.55 meters okay now you have to look at your 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 mass it has to be kilograms if it's not given in kilograms, you have to convert it to kilograms. And then also your height must be in meters. If it's not in meters, you have to convert it to be meters before using the body mass index formula. So you're going to write the formula. Our formula says body mass index is equal to mass divided by height squared. So our mass is 73 divided. Our height was 1.55 and then you square it. Okay. Now, let's, let, let me show you how you do that in a calculator. Okay. When you're using a natural display calculator, it has a fraction button. So you can press the fraction button and then 73 on top. And then the arrow, the arrows that are, they are helping you to go down, then press this one. It will make you go down. And then 1.555 squared. There's a square by button. Then you press your equal sign. Then it gives you the fraction thing. Then the SD, it changes it to a decimal. Okay, so it's 30 point. 38 so we're gonna round it off to 30.39 that would be our body mass index 30.39 now we're gonna use the table to see if this person is overweight when you look at our person at our table this person is more than 30 is actually obese they need to exercise okay let's look at the next question okay, the second question says what is the height of a person with 32 body mass index and has a mass of 125 kilograms okay so you start by writing the formula body mass index is equal to mass over height squared then we substitute the values that you are given the body mass index is 32 and then the mass is 135 kilograms divided by we are actually as the height but the height comes with a formula with a squared. So when you get a, a question like that, you were taught in grade 8, you have one fraction, you make this a fraction. Any number, if you divide it by 1, it becomes a fraction. You have a fraction, an equal sign, and a fraction, 1, 1. You can cross multiply. What do I mean by that? You take the numerator of this side and multiply it with the denominator of the other fraction. The denominator of this fraction multiplied by the numerator of the other fraction okay cross multiply we're going to multiply the 32 with the height squared and multiply the one with the 135 so 32 times height squared is equals to 1 times 135 it will be 135 then because we want height we're going to divide with a 32 both sides and then we'll have height squared is equals to then we punch that in our calculator. 135 divided by 32. Then we get 4,21875. Now you see the squared. To get rid of the squared, we put a square root both sides. So the square root will cancel the square. I'll be left with height. And then I put this under square root. Square root of answer. Then my answer will be 2, comma. 0, 0,5 when I round it to be 2,1 meters. You remember the height is calculated in meters, so this is quite a tall person. It's 2,1 meters. This is how you calculate. Please practice this section, it's not that hard. This is the end of our lesson. Thank you for watching.